this is a really special evening for us. This is our 10th anniversary of our CyberKnife program. Uh, we started this 10 years ago as a, a small program that we didn't know what it was going to become, and it's grown up to be the largest CyberKnife practice in the country and one of the largest in the world. So we're going to celebrate with our patients, our families, our friends, take our tie off, and just have a really special evening. Winthrop is a center of excellence for treating folks who have cancer. We've treated more patients with prostate cancer than any place in the country. So we have the M6 machine, which is special. It's the sort of cutting edge cyber knife that has multi-leaf collimators, which is an innovation where you could really shape the dose of the radiation quite well. So you really get the best of both worlds. You get these thick tungsten leaves that are moving in and out to really shape the dose, and you're also coming from so many different angles so the dose is pre precisely delivered. As a scientist, it's gratifying to see such a technologically sophisticated piece of equipment that combines a robot that can position the accelerator with sub-millimeter accuracy, and to see that technology being brought to bear on uh, improving the lives of these patients in a very profound way, I think is, is the most gratifying thing about the about the CyberKnife. You know, when I see the, my schedule, it's a busy schedule during the day, when I see follow-up from CyberKnife, I know it's going to be a quick, easy visit. I know that the PSAs are going down, and they're doing well. When you come to Winthrop, you're not just seeing a urologist like myself. You're getting a complete comprehensive view, a multidisciplinary consultation. The most important part of our jobs isn't to fly to Tokyo and lecture. It isn't to go to Boston and present data. It's to sit one-on-one -on -one with a scared patient, look him or her in the eye, and say, you're going to be fine. We've got this. At Accuray, we're a very mission-driven company, so it matters what we do every day is get up and try to do something that gives tools to Dr. Haas and the team at Winthrop and other customers around the world to really make a difference for patients as they're going through the process. That's when you know you really have a technology that helps people have quality and quantity of life. And that's what we're striving for. We partnered with Accuray, and through this decade, we've grown in our technological sophistication. And there's been a good cross-pollination of ideas between us and the, and the, the company, and we kind of feel almost part of, of Accuray, so it's very gratifying to see everybody here. Every single person out of the thousand people that do this every day, from the engineering staff, to the people who work on the assembly line, to the folks who make the linear accelerators, to our field teams, every day, every single person gets up and does it to help a patient. It has been really motivational today to be here with so many patients talking about how our product has made a difference in their life. Well, the success of CyberKnife has given me the opportunity to, uh, to plan all kinds of future that I might not have been able to plan otherwise. The side effects were, were literally nil. The team that they have is, is outstanding. Uh, they're like family. You go in and you register and the next time you go back everybody knows your name. I can't say enough about the way I was treated and, and of course the success that I had. To tell you honestly it wasn't my first choice. I wanted to do the holistic uh, treatment first. After meeting with, with Dr. Katz he said I wasn't a patient for that, and I knew I didn't want invasive surgery, so he said, why don't you do the cyber knife? I couldn't be more pleased. I, if you ask me how I felt tonight, I feel better than I did prior because I'm so relieved psychologically that this is over and I feel so good. No after effects at all. This cyber knife, it's the right way to do it. Theoretically, it's perfect. The guy who figured it out must have been an engineer. He wasn't a doctor. So I was impressed, and being a physicist by training, I uh, got to study about the linear accelerator and how it works. If I had to make the decision again as to how to treat my prostate cancer, I would definitely go to Winthrop CyberKnife treatment. I was really at a, at a crossroads where I didn't really know where to reach out to. And when I met Dr. Haas, he sat down with me and he told me about the CyberKnife program. And he didn't try to pitch it for Winthrop but he was telling me about it to help my life. I was able to perform my son's wedding two years ago, and I was grateful to God for that. Two years ago, I underwent the CyberKnife treatment, and at that time, it changed my life because it made me cancer-free. And I'm living life to its fullest right now because of the treatments that I received through the CyberKnife program. It's like a family reunion for me tonight. It's so rewarding as a physician, as, a, as an oncologist, for patients to come up and say, you know, You've really given me a new lease on life. You've allowed me to have an excellent quality of life. I went to see my grand 
child's you know, bar mitzvah or graduation, or I can watch my son or daughter get married. And it's not only about eradicating and getting rid of the cancer, but again, allowing men and their spouses and their families to maintain an excellent quality of life. I have a very dear friend who two years before I had the cyber knife uh, radiation, went through this uh, period of nine weeks of radiation and after the nine weeks he had to have hormones and after the hormones he's still doing testosterone things and injections and I said I'm not going to go through that at all. It was a no-brainer. We, we both agreed that uh, there was the right thing to do, get it finished with, be healthy and enjoy our lives. We just celebrated 60 years and went to Paris for a weekend. We're off to India next month. The CyberKnife program at Winthrop is successful because we believe in it wholeheartedly. It's a garden to us. We tend to it every day. We watch it grow. We watch it blossom. Um, it's what we live in. It's our passion. And I think it's kind of symbolic you know, that, that all of us are here on, in the greatest city on the planet with, I think, the greatest treatment team on the planet. What makes this institution so special and so unique cannot be replicated. It can't be mass produced like machine parts. It's a unique patient-centered culture and it celebrates collaboration and places an appreciation of every single individual who's participating in a patient's care. It's a culture that promotes research and scholarship and one that dedicates itself to continual improvement. Today's not just a 10-year celebration of Winthrop utilizing an amazing machine. It's a celebration of patients, of physician and physicist visionaries, and of a hospital leadership that's driven for excellence and that has accepted nothing short of greatness. Thank you so much.